Hey guys, how's it going? Now in this video I'm going to be sharing my thoughts on the 8 year anniversary of GK Online. So there's pretty much nothing else to make a video out of, so I thought that I'd make a video out of this. So yesterday on October 1st, GK Online turned 8 years old. So that means GK Online first came out 2 weeks after the original release of GK 5 on September 17th. And then GK Online came out on October 1st. So that makes the 8 year anniversary yesterday. Now I don't really know what to say about this day because Rockstar has both a love and hate relationship with the GK Online players. The GK Online players are sometimes happy at Rockstar, like when they added the Los Santos Tuners update, and sometimes they're mad at Rockstar, like when they released the new Expanded Enhanced trailer that wasn't really that good at all. So sometimes Rockstar is good, they make good things, and sometimes they're bad when they do bad things for the community. But if there's one thing that I don't understand about this entire thing, is how Rockstar didn't even take the time to acknowledge the fact that one of the greatest games it ever produced is now 8 years old today. Rockstar didn't do anything that acknowledged it, they didn't make any video on it, they didn't make no community post on it, they didn't even do anything special in game, they did nothing to celebrate this. Rockstar should have done at least something to celebrate their favorite game turning 8 years old. Rockstar really loves GTA 5 because they seem to milk it forever. They're milking it to three consoles at this point. While their newest game, Red Dead, they don't even pay that much attention to that, even though that's five years newer. So GTA 5 is their highest priority and they don't even do anything to celebrate it turning eight years old. What Rockstar should have done is, they should have at least gave away something free in game or something, like free cash, just to celebrate the fact that their favorite game is now eight years old today. But Rockstar didn't really do that this time. But anyway, that's just going to be my opinion on the 8 year anniversary of GTA 5. So I just thought that I'd make a video on this even though I'm a day late. Because there's literally nothing else to make a video on in the GTA 5 community at the moment. So I thought that I should just make a video on this. So anyway, let me know in the comments down below what your opinion is on GTA 5 turning 8 years old. And like always, don't forget to like and subscribe to see more videos like this on the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video.